Hello everyone! In this video, I will show you how you can import and animate custom models. In this tutorial, I will be using Donald Trump and a silly dance as an example. To start, find your custom model. Sketchfab is an excellent website to download some custom models, which I would recommend where you can find some for yourself as well. Please be mindful of the copyright some of these creators have on these models. When downloading a model, make sure that the model is in FBX form. After having your custom model, navigate to the Mixamo website through a search engine or in the description. Once there, upload your custom model. Please note that you need an account with Adobe before you can use Mixamo, although Mixamo is completely free and does not require a subscription. After uploading your model, select the animation you wish your model to have. In this tutorial, I select a funny dance from the collection. There are lots of animation in Mixamo, so make sure that you explore all the options there are. Once happy with your selected animation, download it. Make sure to download it as an FBX file for best results. With the animated model downloaded, import it into Roblox Studio using the Import 3D feature. Doing this will import the model. When the model is imported, the size is likely to be incorrect. Use the Scale tool to fix the model into the correct size. Once you are happy with the model, it is time to import the animation. Navigate to the Animation Editor and select on the Custom Model. Expand the Animation Editor tab. Name the animation to your liking. Click on the three dots on the left, then on Import, then on FBX Animation. Import the same FBX file as the model. After importing, the animation should appear within the Animation Editor. Once happy with the animation, publish it to Roblox. Once the animation is published, make sure to copy the animation ID. Now it is time to make Roblox use the animation. Within the custom model, look for the animation controller instance. Once found, make a new animation within the animation controller. Within this animation, paste the animation ID copied before. Next, make a script within the animation controller. Copy and paste the code from the description into the script. After pasting the code, the animation will work. I hope this video helps with your Roblox development. Please comment for feedback and suggestions.